Good morning. This is, uh, my name is James Marion Kemp. Uh, the purpose of this video log is to uh, inform you about a project that I'm working on. And I'm working on many projects. Uh, at any rate, today is starting out to be a beautiful day. It's Saturday, uh, May 13th, uh, 2023. Uh, this originally was intended to be a video for a very special group, a group of people who helped me to uh, make my first full-length uh, video, film, motion picture, whatever you want to call it. Um, and the purpose of this video is to avoid uh, uh, spinning your wheels not inventing, not inventing, reinventing the wheel. Um, I finished the editing of that movie. And let's just start off with definitions. Uh, so the people who do social influencing this day typically are on uh, YouTube. They like to call themselves YouTubers or whatever. Uh, I'm one of those people. I have two YouTube uh actually three YouTube channels um, based on different business interests of mine and this particular interest involves the fact that uh, when we went into pandemic mode in March of 2020 I decided it was time to start recording some of the events and instead of following up with the schedule of uh, video logs, I decided that I would make a film. Uh, I wrote the script. The title of the film was Veil of Secrecy. Uh, Veil of Secrecy has a pedigree that goes all the way back to 1978 when I was a high school teacher in a small town in Illinois. And uh, the last year that I taught there, my speech class and I created a script and a short film, it was very short, um, it was recorded on 8mm film, it was a silent movie. Uh, since then it's been, uh, I've, I've edited it over and over again. Um, I still have the 8mm film somewhere in my uh, apartment slash <coughs> studio in Salem, Oregon. Uh, right now I'm in my studio in McMinnville, Oregon. It's taken me three years to edit that film from all the different uh, green screen uh, sub videos, I guess you'd call them, uh, that, I, that were recorded in the process of making Veil of Secrecy 2020. The original black and white 8mm film was entitled simply Veil of Secrecy. Um, I think it was, a, oh, it was a virtue production because the group of people back in 1978 had been in a play that I directed uh, titled Veil of Secrets. No, pardon me. Um, it was a, it was a, uh, well, okay, we'll be editing this one out. Start again. Um, back to the subject. The subject is my creation of a, uh, what, what I would call an investment cooperative in exchange for uh, being in my film and working on my film as cast or crew I gave each person in the final titles um, at one share, one equity share in that film. They are the owners, I have one share in that film. Let's go into the structure of uh, the entity itself uh, it's being published right now on my uh, internet site, uh, The Lemonade Network, which I created during the pandemic. Uh, that little by little it became obvious that uh, so many of us who were involved in live theater were unable to perform or be involved in live theater during the pandemic. and. The, th the theaters, of course, many of them were closed down uh, and 
have had just a heck of a time reopening and uh, attracting again all of the audience members that they were accustomed to prior to the pandemic. So to make this thing really brief, I also created a company in 2008, uh, Pop Spedster and Company. Pop Spedster is a 503C, uh, let's see, what's that called? 50C, 5023C nonprofit. In other words, it's an educational nonprofit corporation. Actually, it's a, it's a uh, more of a partnership. Uh, uh, going back to, I, I began uh, publishing internet uh, data, internet sites in 1994. Five, I believe, in 1998, uh, in cooperation with friends and relatives, I created a, uh, the uh, a company called Cyberspace Memorial Service. The idea of that service was that we would sell um, memorial sites on the internet for the deceased. Um, that business existed for maybe three or four years was probably still on my credit record all the way up until 2008, let's see, uh, probably, maybe it still showed up in 2011, as late as that. At any rate, the name of that company was Cyberspace Memorial Service. The owners of that Cyberspace Memorial Service uh, were given an interest in Pop Spencer and Company, the nonprofit. I'll uh, list that information in any, in any forms that I have. Right now, the Lemonade Network publishes three original film slash videos slash musicals, etc. Um, these are The Veil of Secrecy 2020, also on the Lemonade Network a uh, show that I've worked on since 1996, starting in Coos Bay, Oregon, uh, titled And the Snowfalls. Uh, was first, I first produced it and directed it in 1996 in Coos Bay at the old On Broadway Theater. Um, as late as 2019, I believe, or 18 maybe, uh, the Spotlight Community Theater in Staten, Oregon, did the premiere of my musical adaptation of that original play uh, by uh, Nicholas Laszlo, who also wrote, um, actually he wrote that script. Uh, it, it wasn't really a success, but it was uh, another form of his original uh, film script, um, Little Shop, uh, Shop Around the Corner, or Little Shop Around the Corner. Uh, which was a film uh, in that 19, famous 1939-1940 era. S also uh, on that, uh, it, it, as an interest of, of uh, Lemonade Network, uh, I also publish the uh, performance of, a uh, live performance of my original script actually what I call a photo play, um, The Dead of Spoon River, which is a sequence of poems uh, based on Edgar Lee Masters' Spoon River Anthology, uh, in which I have, uh, that, and, and uh, my, my The Dead of Spoon River was in fact also produced at uh, actually Spotlight Community Theater, I don't believe they've been created yet. It was probably Almsville Community Theater at the Little Red Schoolhouse in Staten, Oregon, which eventually became uh, Spotlight Community Theater. And uh, recording of that is uh, on can be found on the Lemonade Network. Um, so what this video addresses is the creation of a, an investment cooperative. Uh, there were 45 people, including myself, who all appear in the credits of the video film, Veil of Secrecy 2020. 
I gave each of those participating 45 members uh, one equity share in an investment uh, cooperative which uh, we're forming right now and that's one of the purposes of this video uh, as I said when I started rather than reinventing the wheel um, I'm going to put basic information into this video uh, and I'll, I'll be publishing it on um, three of my uh, YouTube sites uh, channels rather and also it'll be available on the Lemonade Network. Uh, the idea of the uh, investment cooperative is that each person in that cooperative owns one share of the film Veil of Secrecy 2020. Uh, they do not own the Lemonade Network, they do not own Pop Spedster and Company, uh, they own that one piece of uh, that one asset actually uh, Veil of Secrecy 2020. Uh, they will have access to promoting it, uh, to making money on it, but in this kind of setup uh, all of everything is going to be based on uh, three level, four levels of participation in a in an investment cooperative. If that, if everyone, if each individual of 45 members uh, can achieve or can is capable somehow of meeting the communication standards of that community, uh, they will be a fully active participant. Uh, their stock can be offered for sale, but uh, must be approved by a majority uh, of, of the 45 owners. Uh, however, that is expressed, whether in person, by uh, Zoom meetings, or uh, uh, by proxy. Uh, some of the some of the people who own shares are either minors or are people who have developmental disabilities, uh, in which case uh, a, a proxy may be more appropriate. So on the uh, on the table that I created that was published on the Lemonade Network yesterday, there will be all. Th four levels of participation. First is, of course, passive. Everyone automatically qualifies as a passive participant in the co-op. Uh, the next level is active. Active means that you have uh, agreed to and established a communication uh, media, hopefully through Google with uh, Gmail and all of the assets that are available through through Google. Uh, what is not available through Google is a social um, a social networking network platform. And some of you like Facebook, some of you hate Facebook. Um, we have LinkedIn as a possible choice. Uh, I yesterday I spent all of my time trying trying to create my own social network uh, and believe me that was a pain time consuming and that's why we're doing this video of course um, and then of course then you have legal status uh, are you actively participating or has uh, someone are you participating for someone else as a proxy of that person minor uh, disabled person with disabilities and then finally eventually there will be situations where you don't really care for the entire idea and you can either elect to become a member with a null, N-U-L-L, status or you may automatically become null status simply because you have not participated or any indicated any interest in participating in any way. Uh, by, by notifying any of the other 45, the other 44 members, the other 44 members. Um, when your membership, when your stock certificate goes into null status, 
then of course it automatically becomes available for sale. Uh, how does this investment work? Well, the whole idea is to not only increase the value of your individual stock certificate, but also hopefully your activities will increase the value of all 45 participants, either by your promoting Veil of Secrecy 2020 through social media, uh, through something simple as email, uh, or, or actually establishing your own presence as a social influencer on the internet. Uh, the, the simplest way is to do that is simply to have a Gmail account where you will have cloud storage and also access to Google's um, YouTube channel and, and where you can actually set up a channel and publish your own um, stuff. Uh, of course, there are always uh, opportunities with, uh, with uh, platforms such as GoFundMe where you can have friends and neighbors or whoever um, donate to you. I would seriously suggest to all 45 members that somehow they set up a business bank account uh, and use it uh, as a source when you are uh, doing financial transactions. Uh, I would suggest that you use a company like Square very easily, just their free product linked to your business banking account so that funds can be transferred and so forth. Those are the main ideas for today. I do plan on updating this video log. I have no idea, excuse me, haven't had any breakfast yet. I know how, I don't know how often I'll be doing that. Um, it would be nice if everyone of the 45 members could participate. I have, I have a professional uh, level uh, Zoom account uh, where, where I can record all of the meetings. It would be nice to have some kind of a group meeting, whether it be by proxy, whether it be by <coughs> active members or the entire 45 people. So uh, I'm open to suggestions. Uh, I'm simply setting up a structure whereby you, the 45 members, uh, owning uh, a certificate, a uh, stock certificate in Veil of Secrecy 2020, have a valuable asset. Uh, once we're up and running uh, and we determine that some anyone wants to sell uh, their stock certificate immediately, then I can list that stock available for sale on the Lemonade Network on the internet. Um, as I said before, uh, the sale of that stock at whatever price has to be approved by the other members, by at least the quorum, however we define a quorum, a majority, a simple majority of the other 45, of the other 44 members. And finally, my apologies to Randy Callaghan. Randy contributed a number of songs. He's a professional musician, songwriter, etc. Um, Randy wrote one song in particular for the film, and uh, I left him, yesterday I published a, uh, a uh, page uh, for the owners, which I will be changing today to show the status as for everyone as being passive, everyone's automatically a passive member, but I forgot to include Randy, so Randy will be on the list today. And that really pretty much sums it up, so I'll be editing this little video and putting it up where everybody can see it and be sure and check my WordPress blogs that appear on Facebook um, and on WordPress. My hosting service bases its uh, development uh, tools on WordPress even though I don't use them. I've been publishing HTML sites uh, since uh, 1995 I believe maybe 98 at any rate I want you all to have a wonderful day uh, let's make Veil of Secrecy 2020 a fine little art house film 
and those are some key words. Um, isolation film, it's it kind of unique in that it was developed by the people in the cooperative. Uh, many of them actually uh, doing selfies with green screens in their homes during a pandemic. And that's why you can read all about my theory on isolation film on my WordPress site. Uh, once again, this is James Marion Kemp, K-E-M-P. By the ER to be seen, hands and faces clean.